You can say, oh, true beauty comes from within. But try walking around with a distorted face and having to live it. I look in the mirror and I think, wow, big difference. I felt like a monster, I really did. A sideshow circus clown. Raji Nareen Singh is one of the world's best known victims of black market cosmetic surgery. Unhappy with her looks, the transgender activist visited a fake doctor who pumped her face, breasts, hips and buttocks full of a toxic solution which hardened under her skin. But now, after extensive surgery to remove the concrete-like substance, her face has been transformed. I'm ready for the world. I don't know if the world's ready for me. <laughs> oh my God, look at my face. I mean, really, look, look at it. Don't I look younger? Come on, you have to admit it. And, and look at my smile, you actually see my teeth now. See, before, you know, when I smiled, my lip didn't lift. Now when I smile, you see teeth. I think it's, it's definitely been worth it. I always have had a, a core belief that one's beauty is from within and not, not, not wanting to sound cliche, but you know, that is the truth. A person's true beauty is from within, but we live in a world that is very superficial and you know, people look at the way you look. Dr. John Martin has treated Raji for several years and is now seeing the results of her latest surgery. Okay. Good to see you. Good to you see look you. wonderful. Oh, thank you. Mm. Yeah. Everything going well? Yeah, good. Good. good, good, yeah. The first time I saw Raji to now, there's been an enormous improvement because she really had these very large nodules on her cheek that were just sticking out and they were very distinct large nodules so that you could really see them. Now she has a few little nodules, but you can't really see them so that the whole appearance of her face is just much softer and smoother and just not nearly as deformed as it had been. Much yeah, flatter, my much face smoother. was like out to here basically. Right. Yeah. We talked as about a, the mountains yeah. that you had that were really just all like concrete in there. A combination of ultrasound treatments and anti-inflammatory injections allowed Raji to eventually have some of the substance removed from her face. All of those years of your treatments got it to the consistency of like a tire and they said that was perfect because it wasn't too soft that it, but it wasn't too hard. She recently underwent an intense course of surgery to remove the filler from her chin, lips, eyelids and cheeks. Oh my God, I had four surgeries in a span of seven weeks. We're talking surgery, week of recovery, surgery, week of recovery, and so on and so on and so on. Raji still has nodules in her breasts and buttocks, but performing surgery on them may be too risky. When it comes to the rest of my body, it is a concern for me. I don't quite know what I'm gonna be facing in the future. I have to say my confidence has definitely improved. I lived with this situation for about 10 years and I was doing my thing regardless. I mean, I had some really down moments, times where I didn't think I could go on, but I was pressing on. But I have to say this blessing came out of left field and I'm really, really happy it did because it has changed my life. It really has. My friends and family are so happy for me and amazed. Good, how are you? Good to see you. You look gorgeous. Oh, thank you. She just looks amazing and happier. I'm just very blessed that somebody got to help her with this. Now she doesn't have to worry about going to a restaurant or a, a supermarket or down the street without people staring at her. I'm a big personality, so I know I'm going to always get stares, but the stares are a little different. And she's now got the confidence to focus on her love life. And who knows, I might even get married soon. Oh. I can make you my maid of honor. Oh. The men's situation has improved. Getting approached a lot more. Uh, and just the whole uh, reaction from men it seemed to be, seems to be a lot more receptive and they seem to be really attracted to me. Well, you know, I am a cougar. <laughs> oh my God, I love me some young men. <laughs> I'm sure a lot of men are gonna look at her more and um, I'm sure she's gonna have a, a, a line waiting for her to come and, and, and pick which one she wants, actually. <laughs> Now, Raji is pursuing her acting career, 
and continuing to raise awareness of the dangers of black market surgery. I've been doing a lot more uh, auditions and uh, monologues and that sort of thing. So I'm really thinking that maybe the casting directors will be a little more receptive to me now. As much advocacy as I've done worldwide against black market injections, it's still going on. Um, I think maybe what I'm seeing in the community is it's tapered down a bit. And I would like to think that you know, maybe it has something to me being open about my story and sharing my story with the world.